As an intern, at Motor Trend, I've had the opportunity, to drive many, various cars home. Over the course, of the past year, I've had more seat, time in our long-term, Civic than any, other car. I remember getting, sticker shock when, I first saw the price of, the touring trim, it didn't make sense to me. Why would someone, spend nearly $28,000 on the Civic? After one drive of, our Civic Touring and I, understood. Honda's updated Civic, remains an amazing, value for money, despite the rising MSRP. I had just driven, a friend's Audi A3, and I felt an immediate, connection to that, car after getting into, the Civic. This new Civic, felt like a worthy, adversary while undercutting, the luxury car price point, of the Audi. Although the tech, in the Honda wasn't, quite up to the beautiful Google, Maps overlay found, in the A3, everything felt much, more premium than the previous, generation Civic. The digital dashboard, paired with an, intuitive interface, shows that you, don't need the Germans, to get the latest, in modern technology in, new cars today. Its sharp display, compares well to the, Audi's available virtual, cockpit instrument cluster, display in terms of clarity, and the LED headlights light up, a dark road like any, other luxury sedan. The next time I, was in our Civic, it's decently sound, insulated interior and, adaptive cruise control system, made it a breeze to, take from our office, in Los Angeles to our, best driver's car competition, in Monterey though, Eric previously wished, the gap the system left, between your car, and the car ahead, was a tad closer. I made the same, road trip with my, current generation A4 almost, exactly a year prior, and I felt completely, at home in the Civic. There's something about this, car that lets you sink, into the driver's seat, and allows for peaceful, highway driving, and it's no wonder, that our long-term Civic, has been used on, a number of road trips, and has covered over 27,000 miles, within our short time, of ownership.